Please select a delivery. We're, we were supposed to be listening to tapes this whole time. Fuck, damn. That was the point of the episode. Boss, how are you back on your feet so quickly? The meat warp. There's a non-smoking ward. Boss, if I listened to everything the doctor said, I'd probably die in here. <laughs> no point waking up after nine years for that. Well, having you out of that bed makes things a little easier. Bad news, huh? Mm. Things are looking worse. Go on. They found out about you waking up. And the man on fire picked this time to wake up, too. We'll have to move forward ahead of schedule. Miller already has the preparations underway. We'll have to wake up your neighbor, too. So he's not. He seems awake now. No. Well, he's not actively conscious yet, at least. He was a oh, time of venom. In his mind, that past no longer exists. Your past is his past now. He's going to be your phantom. Not some no simple world. diversion. He'll act as the new big boss. And the act just isn't for Cypher. He'll be your face on the world stage. Until the time comes for your resurgence. You make it sound easy. We've been busy over the last nine years. Mm -hmm. His altered state of consciousness has helped us implant powerful come suggestions on, okay. through induced hypnagogia. He's experienced all your missions on record and shares all your knowledge and experience to make him believe that he is the one true big boss. No one around him will doubt that he's the big boss they know. So, is he the real big boss or a stand in? What does that mean to him? Nothing. The human brain is capable of many illusions of pain and the future. What happens from here depends yeah. on his skill. You can vouch for that. He was always the best man we had. But no. nine years ago in that helicopter, he threw himself between you and the blast. In that moment, the man you knew died. He died protecting you. And now by becoming no. you, he protects you again. This is just no. a detour in his journey to hell. And don't forget, it's what he wanted. He's in his dog days now. I get it. It's not just him. We'll be putting the people in this hospital in the line of fire. It'll be your shield and necessary diversion to buy some time. They I did mean, all die. All of time. them. Can you all of up? them. Ocelot, all, all of them. It won't be a lie. I won't know his secret either. I'll believe that he's the real big boss. Oh, I yeah, so he did hypnotize himself. Where's the lie in that? Self-hypnosis. There's nothing new in my line of work. Manipulating <laughs> memories. The past. But that's not all. When the time is right, I need to remember that you're the real boss. Frankly, it's getting disconcerting how it's often I'm thinking. doing it. In this year, I did it how does Ocelot up. remember uh, that he's the real? Right. Uh, he it won't be long he hypnotizes himself to unhypnotize himself at a certain right point. Away, but he won't be back to full health and time. Cool. We'll need to take him through his final Th that's, yeah. uh, that's not even a joke. That's again. actually what happened. John. That's I've never forgotten you in these nine years. Bastion saying yes. That's what you really that's what he really needs to remake Metal Gear One and Two for, is that he really needs to kinda account for Ocelot. A little bit. He basically programmed himself to to remember everything for real on a certain trigger, which he knows will happen later. I don't know what that trigger is. So he knows all of this by the time of Metal Gear Solid One. Again. Uh he he might know it by the like now. He might remember everything now. I think he actually remembered it in the outro of the last episode. Oh. Where Miller was like, "Oh, I'll keep helping Venom, but also I'm gonna help his garbage boy kill him." Or no, he was helping Venom, but not Big Boss anymore, because he's mad at Big Boss for choosing Ocelot over him. boys are your clones. They're you, down to the last hair. And? The first boys were raised... Help. Help. Like we thought. What's happening with this Jeep? None of these physics make sense. the other, Eli, has disappeared. Might as well call it abandoned. They're through with him. Where is he? He was in England. Zero is home ground. Apparently he traveled to Africa after that, but that's where he is. <laughs> they didn't really pay attention care. after that. I don't know, you know, Africa, whatever. It's all the same shit. Maybe he found out about his birth. Death or oil. He'd be 11 or 12 by now. Old enough to think. <laughs> awesome. That seems kind of racist. He might still be alive. On his own, there. 
I wouldn't bet on it. John, <laughs> if he is alive, what's the plan? I have nothing to say to him. Treat him like a human being, just another person. Well, there you go. Boss, this war business you and Miller started. You still there? Since yeah. The industry spread okay, the just PS, made sure. I'm listening to the tape. I got scared. Oh. We've had enough problems that we can't be like, no, this nonsense. Unify their frame of mind. Guns for hire continue the war. Then enrich the economy good. with their spoils. Oh my god, this is his voice so good. He's such a good dog. He's such a good guy. A new business model. You might even call it a war economy. Before long, you might, or, rather the or you will, will, will but be drawn you to could. This. Probably only a few decades Someone before could. it's told. It's not far off at all. Still no leads on Zero. We don't yeah. even know whether he's still alive. But the protocol he put in motion yes. is making steady progress. Every day, I don't know who could tell if he's still alive. alive. We played Metal Gear Solid 4 already once before. Big Brother Zero. And it'll happen yeah, before I mean... anyone even realizes. I don't like it. You're the big brother of the battlefield. You must get Not being Beans, that's not good. Oh, I fricked it. Oh, good. Nice to know the killer bee actually sucks ours. Cool. It can't kill a thing. No. Sure can't. When that happens. Opposition will no longer match the lines on the map. And boss, with no borders left. What difference can What? Bark! Hey, quit kidding around. Why did I just Snake? die? Snake! I think the helicopter crashed. Did did it crash on me? <laughs> I think it might have crashed on you. I thought it was going another direction, but then I also I just exploded, so... I was like, yeah, yeah I did it. <laughs> just fucking vaporized. <laughs> Boss, this war business you and Miller started. Since the industry spread out to the PFs, it may have a favorable influence on Cypher. To a ruler, an everlasting enemy is convenient. By directing the public's animosity outside his borders, he can Ooh, unify their idea. frame of mind. Guns for hire continue the war. An everlasting the enemy. I didn't remember that for Stellaris. War as a remember that time you killed a helicopter with a handgun? The public mind. I do remember that. I bet no one else you will. Nope. Not a soul. I bet everyone's gonna be like, wow, I can't believe Dan sucks as bad at Metal Gear Solid 5. It's like, cool. Probably only a few decades before it takes hold. You know, whatever. It's not far off at all. Still no leads on Zero. We don't even know whether he's still alive. But the protocol he put in motion... Ah, so good. Skip the house. Every day, Sigan's web covers a little bit more of the globe. Total information control. Big Brother Zero. And it'll happen before anyone even realizes. I don't like it. You're the big brother of the battlefield. You gotta extract him. Of the world's military power. And soon, Zero will have nations in his. He'll erase the Cold War. All war from people's <laughs> minds. And with it, the world's borders. Zero's will, <laughs> his influence, will be unleashed with nothing to stem the tide. When that happens, Opposition will no longer match the line on the map. And boss, with no borders left, what difference can we make? War will have lost any true meaning to the world. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Wheels of economy turning. Another product bearing down the capitalist conveyor belt. Hmm. The future your friend Miller wanted. He's coming too. Roger that. Shot Miller. Perhaps it's already too late. But human will should only be handed down and nurtured by human hands. It can't be entrusted to the system. Especially not that soul. It's true, Miller's pretty capitalist. Left in his wake. No I mean, happens, yeah, he did he did we'll sort of accidentally invent McDonald's. Our truth. 
until next time. Big boss. That is the implication of him using the name McDonald. <laughs> you gotta extract him. Using a private network, we get information, but we have no way to trace his location. That means the details are still fuzzy at this point, but apparently some new bioweapon was used. As mm. soon as he noticed the dip in his vital signs, he had his stomach pumped and even underwent blood dialysis. But he didn't fully recover. Mm. Ironically, if Zero kept more company, he'd have been safe. Since the incident, his speech and actions have been getting more unhinged by the day. Oh, He's probably zero, been no. rushed to another safe house for intensive care. But the location is a complete mystery. That's the way he operates. He went to incredible lengths to make sure his great escape went unnoticed. So far, I know at least Langley and the Pentagon were involved. He had a blackout triggered in New York to disrupt the transportation and information grids. And at least two submarines were sighted off the coast. Boss, get down. The personnel That's an enemy gunship. Stay low and crawl along the ground. That should enable you to sneak past enemies. Thanks, a lot. Of dummy ops Everything's fine. Stretching across multiple organizations. It's safe to say not one of the people involved knew what they were moving or to where. All top secret. No trail, no leads. He's living up to his name as usual. Only this time, even I can't find him. Now, the only mm -hmm. record of his location lies within the cipher AI that was at the heart of the escape plan. And that's closed off, with its data sealed away in a secret location. Skullface was able to put together this assassination attempt, but even he can't possibly know where Zero is now. I'll keep searching, mm -hmm. but when you're up against mm -hmm. he who controls information, it's gonna yeah, be a it's long battle. Shit. Boss, it was Anderson after all. That's right, the man who went by Sigan during Operation Snake Eater. Following Zero's disappearance, he's taken over command of Cypher. Oh. Well, to be precise, the AI he oversees has. The idea to have an AI act for Zero came about in 74, when the data from the mammal pod penetrated NORAD. Clearly, an AI couldn't be allowed to make its own decisions. So they would take away its ability to act, and instead, create a specialized system in which the AI, bound by specific rules, filters the massive amounts of data it collects before passing it on He's to coming too. Hey, mm -hmm. isn't this Metal Gear Solid 2? A system yeah. Uh, yeah. People, by the people. Yeah, this is Sigint inventing so those AIs. Do it. DARPA apparently brought Strangelove on board to head it up. Oh. She was forced out after a certain incident. The direction of the project Whoa, why is that helicopter shooting? Existence was scrubbed after her departure. What the fuck? Before Zero lost consciousness as his Oops, condition sorry. worsened, he left instructions for Anderson. Through a cutout, of course. Zero went out of his way to hide your location in order to keep you safe. This meant sacrificing his own protection. It was the only way to Why? ensure you could stand alone as your own man. Here I am. The only so didn't want to be a but, for, the but he's the bad guy, right? Zero? Yeah. Now. No, well, Cypher was the bad guy. Well, Cypher the organization is because they stole, they fucking sperm jacked the big boss. Also, hey, people that I didn't know to do. It's called the Patriots. It's all about ensuring that the concepts driving society appears the same in the mind of each person in that society. About maintaining the identity of the individual. And yet having that individual willingly make up part of the whole. I guess it's Awkward. fitting to call that patriotism. Creating a united world. Zero's will is already fading into a shadow of what it once was. Systems, guidelines, rules, laws. When you take a mentality and fix it in a solid shape, put it out there in the hands of people, it can only begin to decay. No mentality can last forever. Kind of like the boss's the wish dies. for a united the world. I mm. wonder what that means. I still feel so sad for how this big boss took the way the boss is the boss's will. Yeah. As a betrayal. Kind of maybe, yeah. Oh shit. This is playing. Never mind.
What are we listening to? I don't know, I was pretty sure it should have been in plain view. Zero, did you hear that? Thank you for coming. Yeah. Please. Hey, it's him. What's what's he doing? You're and pause. Yes, pause. Is it that odd? I suppose the cuffs have gotten a bit loose. Although truth be told, I have been spending more time in pajamas as of late. No. I'm kind no. of a lazy prick. Tie, perhaps. Not the most fashionable pattern, I admit. No, he's very nice. How sweet. Will you take a little brandy? <laughs> I am 14. You're hardly under age, after all. Oh, wait, that's right. She actually isn't. <laughs> Please, sit. Hmm. Pacifica Ocean. <laughs> that's a what? stupid name. Ah, yes. You've already begun. Hmm. <sighs> Not bad. A schoolgirl through and through. Even he won't suspect otherwise. Mm. Here you are. I wonder Thanks. who he means. I heard you were sick. Poppycock. I just like to take a little time off work. You? You must feel that way sometimes. <laughs> anyway, I could hardly greet my oh, first guest from you. that damned bed. I, uh, missed my chance to get you snoring. <laughs> now I'm twice as glad I got ready in time. Drink before it gets cold. English this breakfast is tea. All I have, I'm afraid. Hmm. What? Why? Is... I don't know. This is about as normal as this shit gets. There were eight candidates before you. Meaning you will be the ninth Paz Ortega Andrade. What happened to the others? They're in the next room. Dead. They've been taking it easy these past few months. Oh, Dead. fuck. Do you see any windows here? No. I've gotten used to it, this life. I am who I am, after all. And I've had my fill of cursing this bloody dent. <laughs> Oh, beans. But I can't help sometimes. Wishing I could see the stars. What should I do? Well, you... You could go outside. Go up to the roof. Wait for the clouds to pass. You would have a view of Manhattan. And a pretty one, too. But once the wind blows, and the clouds pass, you can look up and see a sky full of stars. Even here. You've had a hard time getting to where you are. Ye yes Sewer rats lead better lives. Oh. I know. Extreme training. Starvation. I mean, he knows all about being Days a spy. Without sleep. Abandoned. Hurt and all but killed in every By the way, way being a spy people. sucks ours. Some yeah. of your compatriots died. Others betrayed you, left you for dead, and you did the same to them. But through it all, you survived, and you alone made it here. Just look at you. Nope. So everything you've been through. Yes. These are really intense. Consider this mission a reward for the mountain you've climbed. Thank you. Yes, well, you know what's next. Yes. And you are prepared. <coughs> yes. I believe you. That ever so slight tan. You're going to extract him. If I didn't know better, I'd say you really did grow up around the equator. 
but it runs deeper than that. One look at you, and I see a wide-eyed student yearning for peace. Born Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. I can see it all. How much preparation have you done? A little. You'll be perfect for this. You gotta extract him. Snake. I'll share everything I know about him. Mm. But you mustn't forget who you're dealing with. If he were to get the better of you, well, I deeply regret having put you in that position. But beyond mm. that, I'm putting my life in your hands. Oh, I'm right, the screen, sorry. None of my friends call me that. Tea's gone cold. Shall I make some more? I know we are the only ones here. Hmm. <laughs> oh. There is no one in the other room. And how do you know that? You said I was your first guest. No, mm. I haven't had this much fun in quite but a while. But he said there were other pauses. Mm. He must have been lying. All right, then. Cypher has been in hiding ever since his grand experiment. No one's seen him in years. All we hear are orders delivered by proxy. He's coming, too. Does that sound Roger familiar? That. Yeah. You met with him face to face in order to contact Big Boss. Mm. <laughs> Oh no. Tell this is a strangely uncomfortable tape. Where is Cypher? If I remember correctly. Where is Zero? <laughs> yep, this is the I've gross never one. Known choice. Where I was born, the language I speak. I've never had the freedom to choose for myself. But you, right now, are free. Do as you will. This Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. It may. Will you really kill Zero for me? Not for you. Why did she but want to kill all... Zero again? I can't remember. Right. Zero. Um, no. House Kitchen. Tenth Avenue. He's hmm. undergoing treatment there. Hmm. Not exactly Hyde Park. His Interesting. His medical needs keep him from moving around. That is why he summoned me there. The other residents are of varying race and ages. But in reality, all 40 units are cipher personnel. It took him 10 years to replace the original occupants. He's got places like this all over the world. No better place to hide a needle than a stack of needles. To be fair, if someone was like, hey, you want to become yeah, an employee of cipher? And your your job is to not tell people about how if somebody's living here. No I'd be like, yeah, yeah. How much you gonna pay like, me? Even the d d you wouldn't even have to pay me that much. Officially, the floor does not exist. The only access is by a secret staircase, one floor down. He's coming too. Roger that. Shades of World War II. Nobody realizes the entire building is a setup. People go in and out all day. Mm. But they're all cipher. The building blends right in with the rest you of You gotta extract him. They disseminate rumors that a gang operates out of the building. That keeps most outsiders 
the way. And most of them are there as security. I don't like it. It's very clever. Case of an emergency. It is pretty clever. Even they don't know what they're really protecting. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. Phone lines. Watch and switch. It is all Okay, subject is in. Satellite and cameras inside and out. Should he need it, there is a sealed off water conduit that can be used to escape to the Hudson River and from there to the sea. But from the outside, it is just another building. Wow, this would be super cool if this whole disguise. thing wasn't blown by a dumb schoolgirl. Yeah. Thanks, Puzz. But, um... The Major believes zero suspicion equals total security. Very bold. It's just the kind of ruse I'd expect from him. So long no. as no one's suspicions are aroused, you could hide there forever. Mm. On the other hand, if someone figures it out, there are dozens of ways in. And he's so paranoid about information slipping out, no one involved has the full picture. That ignorance is a weakness. The downfall of a need-to-know system. The pitfalls are clear. Mm. Circumventing them. But I wonder if he still would bother living there after he summoned Paz there. He, he does, though. Why is he a moron? He, he shouldn't have, but... Hate? He never left me to die. I owe him my life. I'm bound to repay the favor. Any way I can. Uh. But that's not what you really want to know. What you want to know is, do I hate Big Boss? <laughs> <laughs> I don't hate the man. I do deserve a little more of his gratitude. But he probably has no idea who I am. Who is Skullface? I have no reason to hate him at all. Chris, you were there when he told you. Damn, I remember nothing about this game. Chris, this... His whole um, thing uh, is that nobody remembers who he is. <laughs> you're, you're just like, wait, who the fuck is this idiot? Even the That's the whole driving force cool. behind his character, why he feels like he should have revenge against Big Boss, is because Big Skull Boss forgot who he was. Ring, rivers, Meanwhile, you're just like, who's this <laughs> fucking chumpo bitch-ass or stupid <laughs> fucking asshole? Are you gonna oh, tell me who he is or no? No! Just like Zero. <laughs> you should remember him! XOF? I know who Skullface is in the game. I mean, who is his real identity? That lava. Oh, that's it. Vengeance is already set as stone. That's it? Too late to change things now. I mean, we never met him in another game. That was the whole point of why he's upset. Oh. Is not mine to make. He had to clean up all the garbage we did in Metal Gear Solid 3, which was a lot of garbage. Mm. And he's pissed because he didn't get a he didn't get a role in the game because of it. Well, anyway, there's that. Ocelot. It's been quite a while. Oh, hey, it's Zero and Ocelot. Took a lot longer for you to surface than I expected, Major. I wasn't planning on coming back at all, but I had no choice. Well, after the Caribbean, my hunch was proven <laughs> right. You wouldn't believe who was behind it. Oh, I have an idea. How did you respond? 
Immediate disinformation campaign. Oslaw was uh, was following the Peace Walker incident. Of course he was. Of course he was. I couldn't cover His boyfriend was in charge of it. Hide the fact that Snake survived, and that should buy us some time. Where is he? En route to an old foxhole of mine, a base in the British sovereign area of Cyprus, the military hospital at De Kelly. Ava's leading the operation. Ooh. Yay, Ava's in charge of helping us. Funny, isn't it? When Skullface was and a dickhole. Reunite like this. Whoops, this, this is an emergency. Is trying to go. Otherwise, as sure as hell would be. Yes, uh, yes, I don't expect you to oh, bury the hatchet the between us. Something simply won't ever happen. Even I can appreciate that. You too can only bear to speak with me from time to time. That's fine. But I don't want Snake to die. Surely we can come together on that. <laughs> there are so few men I can turn to. And you're number one, Ocelot. Keep him hidden. Keep him safe. But I'll stay where I am. And leave the rest to you. That's how it's a dumb idea. <laughs> it's a dumb idea. You know, I heard, I heard it's eight inches long. Deal. <laughs> where he goes, it makes no difference. All that matters is getting him the very best treatment and security. The latter being where you come in. Will he wake up? And if so, when? I have absolutely no idea. But as long as his heart is beating, he will keep fighting. So please, watch over him. This location, it's safe. No one will find him. And if they try, I will deal with them. The information must be suppressed. Which is what you do best. Oh, zero. Nah. Guess you're still at the top of your game, huh? Anything but. I'm sick, Ocelot. Donald's taken over a great deal. He'll be handling this situation from here on as well. Though I wish it weren't so. This will probably be the last time you and I speak. So... You won't say no, will you? I have no choice. Thank you. you save your thanks. <laughs> One more thing. A proposition. Yes. I've prepared a ruse of sorts. One I imagine you'll quite like. What is it? <laughs> you could say, I've made another snake. Major. I'm not talking about the children. A mental <laughs> copy. His phantom, if you like. I don't understand. You will when you get to Cyprus. I've set the ball in motion, but the rest is in your hands. You're good at this kind of thing. The best. All right. I need you on this. If it's in his best interests. I assure you, it is. Look after Snake. He's the toughest son of a bitch I've ever known. Mm. Yes, mm. it's me. You weren't in hospital long. I had trouble finding you. Where is he? Safe. But in the same state as when you last saw him. We've had our misunderstandings, you and I. But as you've made clear, our relationship is strictly business. Therefore, I will limit this conversation to the business at hand. Please understand that I don't dislike you. Not inherently. Where is Snake? Now, now. Settle down, or I'll have to hang up. And then you never hear from me again. Do you understand? <sighs> First, about your boss. I had him moved once he was stabilized. I'm sure it came as quite a shock to you when you woke up. You'll have to forgive me. I told them to stop putting me under. Surely you understand. Specialized medical treatment in places like that can be positively nightmarish. We couldn't have left him there forever. And to be honest, I was entirely comfortable leaving matters in your hands. Don't take it the wrong way. Anyone looking mm. for him would be looking for you. He That's fair. Mm. Yeah, absolutely they would. In fact, I'm still not sharing his location, even now. Problems could arise, 
so instead I'm giving you a point of contact. An introduction to a network of messengers who will lead you to a man. A friend to your boss. I'm sure he's mentioned him before. He knows Snake's location. Ocelot. Any man alive, you mean the weird gay Russian cowboy? Yeah, he's mentioned him once or twice. Or men in the dark. He's known Snake quite a while. Ten years longer than you. <laughs> Kazuhira, I don't care if you don't trust me. But I require your absolute trust in him on this. Snake will be brought back into this world, however long it takes. Understood? The only reason we're having this conversation is because you still have a role to play. Which brings me to the next issue. What happens after he regains consciousness? When Snake wakes up, and he will, he'll need your help again. So when he does, I promise you'll be the first to know. The code phrase will be, V has come to. I'll then mobilize v. the necessary parties. V has come to, remember? That was the to a prologue. tagline of the game. Then, oh. What you like. And also one Just of the first lines of the game comes. after Venom came to. You too. don't need me to tell you that, do you? I know you remember? On you too, no. But I can't it, it played during the, the reminder episode that we just did a minute ago. It's fine, I do this on purpose. Whoops, I accidentally sort of passed that man. I meant to kill him, but apparently I didn't. This. I accidentally saved that man's life. After that, I don't care what you do. Then tell me something. Go on. I only joined you after I found out what you were after. To make the world one, you need Snake for that. And he's already done a hell of a lot for you. He has. So on some level at least, I think you're being straight with me. Then why'd you do that to him? I get what you were trying with Pass. You wanted to get Snake any way you could. But after that, what you did. How could you do that to him? After that, wasn't me. You may not believe this, but I never intended for any of this to happen. My oh my god, Zero didn't send Paz? Well, he, he did. He didn't, he just said he didn't. Like, literally, word for word, the sentence he said before I said that. Anyone who was paying attention would be able to have heard that he did not. Whatever. Send pause. One day, I'll know the truth. Just as soon as the boss wakes up, and then we're coming after you. I'm joking, actually. He did send pause, but it was all the shit that happened, like the yeah. Huey and stuff that he did. Well, yeah. Who could have planned for Huey? Look, people find it funny when I give you grief. Don't be mean. Big boss will wake up, and when he does. Be there for him. Yeah, the whole thing with Paz was actually. Major, I God, from what I remember, I think it was supposed to be a plan to big, bring Big Boss yeah, back to this was your Cypher. Doing. Do you Probably. Like I have no fucking idea what happened to Peace Walker. For this. It is what you were looking for. Yeah. But hey, this is what happened just before Ground Zeroes. The winged dagger of a comrade lost to the sands of Egypt. He served under the boss back in Rayforce. I delivered this pin to her after his death. We were both so very young. From that moment on, she never let it leave her side. She was still carrying it in Salino Yarsk. <gasps> How about the back? Hmm. Ah. Something wrong, Major? Cool. I just pricked oh. my finger. He the pricked back. his finger. On the back of the bed. That's as I probably not good. And this white stitching mm. on the back. From the white berets the SAS wore in the early days. Major? 30th of December, 1941. It's the inscription I made. He's coming too. Roger that. Of course. 
His body was never recovered. This pin badge is the closest thing he has to a gravestone. Aw, he's talking about the sword. And I gave it Aww. to her. She just I kept think. on running her finger over the inscription. Yeah, Must yeah, be. Was. Again, she uttered, as if reprimanding herself for Yeah, it definitely death. was. Sometimes she it takes me a second to remember any of this shit. Embedding the inscription itself into her finger. Like how I you forgot see, zero cent pause, even though it's shining out of the rest. Table that so that's why I was confused. Don't be rude, right, okay? Right, Look, right. I am shit face. I, I got confused yes, and I forgot that he real. did send pause. He didn't send the no uh, doubt about it. Ground Zeroes Good. team. Now I, have no I just killed myself. Whoops. Was that? Was that um? Snake, talk to me. Snake, was he talking to Skullface? He was talking to Skullface. <laughs> he will be again once we're in the game and I cool. don't kill myself by accident this time. Drive yeah. off a cliff harder. Damn. Don't. This game has really weird physics on what immediately vaporizes you and what doesn't, okay? Damn. Two trackers. Secret versus skull phase is zero. Major. Network will span the globe. You may be right. Clouds approaching. Yep. You mean to say people will blindly accept if we're to be immunity, but to it's the world that the boss envisioned will finally become no, it's okay. it's if you, that, that just as you know without need to see men you and uh, don't be quiet uh, 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 and forget it. And no, no, very but yes, our but it had it was it. you see she pressed hard. So, there we embedding go. Embedding okay. the inscription itself into her finger. You see, it's why this spot on the back looks shinier than the rest. He was our brother in arms. Oh. So, don't be rude. Yes, I know it's real. It's Thank sad. You. There's no doubt about so it. Hard. Good. Now I have no regrets. What do I owe you? No regrets. Hmm, I wonder what he means by that. Very well then. It's about our man, Major. He's been making some moves. Miller? Yes, I know. Rhodesia, is it? Yes, and up to his old tricks again. No matter. He'll stumble soon enough. Hmm. Although, he is under my jurisdiction now. And that's what you want to talk about? Not exactly. You see... My being here has made me realize I can still be of use to you. How is so? That's the target. This country is rich with biological resources. Bacteria, oh. nematodes, viruses. I'm sure we can mm. find something here to bring that plan back into action. Forget it. The cleanser project was just another one of my predecessor's daydreams. And the vocal cord parasites? Were an excellent test case for reverse evolution. Nothing more. What matters now is the genetics technology behind that work. With genetics, the clumsiness in targeting an entire race isn't an issue. We can target specific individuals. No need to breed multiple generations of them. Just to get results. That's why... Are they... Are they, are they? Slightly talking about potential the fu the future that will be Fox Eye. Yeah, I was I was about to make a joke about it, but yeah. Why doesn't everybody notice me? Why don't we all interrupt this fucking tape? Using human. Oh, somebody else coming? Enough. Somebody else coming? Want to interrupt the tape? Network will span the globe. Come here, come here. I'm gonna. And our I'm going to kill you. Right into it. You may be right, but will people really settle for an enemy they can't see? Men want to feel righteous, need to see the evil in the enemy they fear. Without it, they'll turn their aggressions inward, find an enemy inside. You know this is true. I see what you're saying. Just as there's... Subject on board. Chuck Miller! ...autoimmune diseases. A man robbed of his enemy develops self-destructive tendencies. And I know all the symptoms. Ethnic conflict, religious strife, terrorism. And with He's coming too. Conflict, Roger that. Deterrence is a joke. That's why we must depend on information control. People need an appropriate context for their lives. 
Whoa. a context that's stimulating without being destructive. Mm. Subject on board. Leave the rest to us. You say people will blindly accept your context without developing any allergies. <laughs> if we're to unite the world, literacy must be suppressed. To what? suppress the information immune system, to borrow your metaphor. Uh, yeah, I don't know my super zero zero on this, but he's got some good points and then some really horrible it's points. It's done, Exo. This world will become one. I have found the way. The world that the boss envisioned will finally become a reality. Race, tribal affiliations, national borders, even our faces will be irrelevant. The nature of communication itself will change, and it will make mankind whole again. Some things can't be undone. My face was taken from me. There's no taking that back. Yeah, uh, I know the fire. We get it. Soul is able to communicate. You have to bring it up every time. Our beams. I have no intention of hiding behind your technological veil, Major. I wear my broken visage, this skull, in the open, so that I may never forget what I've lost. You. What are you? The chain of retaliation is what will truly bind this world together as one. Oh god, he's doing it again. Did Skullface, no, this is a terrible plan. Major. You son of a... The pin. You. Yes, the pin. I thought so. Mm. I knew you would. You're too smart for that. It's too late. They can't extract it. You see. And just like me, when he pricked himself on the pin, I was like, "Oh, he just died, didn't he?" How did you find me? The girl. You made her talk. I'm sorry I couldn't visit or thank you in person, but it has been lovely chatting. And now that I know you're no longer interested in the garden, it's time for you to step aside. You're a busy man, lots to do, so I've left you a little time. Go to hell! How dare you! You planned this all along. Had your own agenda. All these years. Yeah. Now yeah. we see. The world can never truly become one. But the boss. I've been. You've been wrong. <laughs> Uh, Skullface doesn't give a shit about the boss. No, and that's why we hate him. <sighs> exactly. No it's the worst. Just like him. None of you understand the world she saw. I would say the same to you, Major. <sighs> but Zero lives. You steal it. I mean, if you call that living, yeah, I guess that's fair. He's basically brain dead next time we see him. Only I understood. Because of we this. We do know that. Yeah, and we do know that Sigint becomes in charge because he's the one behind the whole AI thing. That man is dead. That should enable you to sneak past enemies. That pin badge. It was a fake. Oh, it wasn't even the Sora's badge. I held on to the real one. I'll take good care of it. And continue the boss's work. Oh, you prick. I'm glad you died an embarrassing death. You have monologues and not even to the right person. Fuck you, man. Is he, is he, um, his plan was to kill everyone, right? That was how he was gonna make the world one? Uh, yeah, he was gonna, uh, unleash the English vocal cord parasite so anyone who spoke English would die. Like, even bilingual people who also spoke English not as their main language, they would get killed by the virus. 
cool. Yeah, so fuck him. I hate that guy. He's a douche. I'm glad. That actually reminds me. Do you know that the episode where we did that uh, is no longer playable in any country? Okay. Why? I think it's because we listened to Gloria. So nobody can watch that episode? Nope. Which kind of makes me want to do an episode where we redo that mission at some point, but also, like, not enough to actually do it. Dead. Oh, hey, it's Zero is visiting Big Boss. That's what this tape is. friends of the SAS know how to keep a secret. A trip to the airport was a little dramatic. But the rest was easy. Still, I've had smoother rides. Oh, sure. Yes, it is. Sculpted myself with my tea. Cause I'm British. I won't tea. be staying long. Tally ho. We actually have a bunch of British fans that I really like, so I don't want to say anything help? too horrible <laughs> about British people. And the left. Did just as you instructed. Has either of them woken? Actually, come to think of it, I'm pretty sure none of them are watching this. So. Wait, does, did Zero make it so that we cut off the Venom's arm? Uh, no, that just kind of happened. Jack. Jack? It's me. You look fit to run a country mile. If you weren't unconscious, but, you know... <laughs> We can't all be winners, can we? Subject them to load. We're stable, but eventually. Yes, of course. We've done everything we can to ensure they're ready to move. Should they wake up? Still, it's been a pretty long time. Hmm. How long will they be here? Indefinitely. It's too dangerous to move them. And so far, no one knows they're here. I see. I am most grateful to you. And I need you to keep it up. We'll do everything we can. Can you give us a moment? Of course. Jack, can you hear me? Nice place, isn't it? <laughs> I went to a lot of trouble bringing you here. Here, where no one will find you. Still, the ocelot's on guard duty. Just <laughs> the ocelot. Maybe knowing that will help you sleep better. I had I really no intention to understand of how his code name works. This <laughs> could be my last chance. If you he's twirling revolvers, you could say first. he's an, he's a revolver ocelot, but I don't know if that's going to catch on. Do you remember the last time I visited? It sounds rather Austin, stupid, if you ask me. Our first mission together, after the boss threw you in that river, broke your arm. <laughs> Good time. <laughs> I talked to you about they Double that, 07. They dropped that nuke. Yes, I that was great. This he was all like, remember the Alamo, because I'm an American. A very <laughs> what man a fucking indeed. stupid voice. Maybe he didn't like the arrangement. In any case, this man, he uh, seems to have done Snake, something. would you like to hear my... Fuck, that was more of a can clap. Which is why. Snake, would you like to hear my American I'm voice? Sick I would like a hamburger. Up here. There's nothing they can do. I always was the. Look, man, you can at least pretend to know. find me funny. <laughs> I'm all right for now. You know, I'm listening to the tape! Well. If you don't wake up soon, I won't remember you when you do. Oh, uh, yeah, because the whole. Thing. Yeah. I don't mind about myself, but what he did to you, I can never forgive. 
Man, remember when he blew up that school girl? That was fucked up. And I doubt he's Well, the skull face did that. Oh, that's what he's talking about. I thought he was talking about him. He's talking about Kaz, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Jack, once your little holiday here is over. <laughs> oh, he knows and it truly I'm does seem like fun. Unconscious anyway, in this black site hospital. I probably won't be around. I'll be somewhere even you can't find me. Basically a tombstone a chiseled into the code of a machine. That is all I'll leave to mark <laughs> my existence. Sigand refuses to back down on this, this AI thing. He wants to put one into space. It's ridiculous. He's gonna Wake put one in a giant friend. Giant submarine robot. <laughs> Time is running short. Name its corridors after its anus. It's very bizarre. Right. Apparently he wants to use robots like Zeke, like as a defense mechanism. It's it's completely ridiculous. Absolutely He's probably going to die by like exploding in a cell or something. <laughs> no, that wasn't him. Mantis killed him, remember? Oh that's right. His blood's gonna get drained or something. <laughs> His blood will probably be stolen by a fucking weirdo. I don't know, I'm just shooting in the dark here, don't mind me. Also, apparently the last 20 seconds of this tape is just dead air, so... Hope you enjoyed that, Jack. I'm British. <laughs> no, you're solid. Episode finale. I'm British. <laughs> I'm British. <laughs> I'm so sorry to all of our British fans that you had to hear that. I love them all. They're great people. The, me too. Also, spoilers. This might amaze people. I'm not good at any accents. Th this might be difficult for people to imagine. You heard my constant Russian accent in Metal Gear Solid 2. Unbelievably, I am not actually good at things. Hello. I am the accent. Oh. Please don't. <laughs> God. I am do accent, yes. That wasn't even Russian. That was like Hello? racist Indian. <laughs> Hello? Bark. Man. What other tapes do we have left to listen to? Are we done? We don't have any. Metal Gear Solid 5 is done. <laughs> We're done with this game. Oh my god, you guys. We not play this anymore. We won Metal Gear Solid 5. <laughs> Goddamn helicopter. We won. The game is it. done. We won. We We're won not 100 it. 100%ing this. Nobody wants to see that. If you immediately go into the thread to say, hey, I want to see that, guess what? Get out. <laughs> Actually, do post that so I can specifically soft ban you. <laughs> For commenting on our videos. God damn it. Extraction arrived. Anyway, love you all lots. Who's excited for our next Metal Gear LP? Spoilers, Nobody it's probably is. not gonna happen for a while because we still have to finish fucking acid. Acid, uh we still have to we still have to finish substance. Because we had to delete the footage from that, because I think you forgot to actually record your audio or something stupid like that. No, my microphone broke, I want to say. That's what it was. Side ops list update. Whoops. Thanks, Stana. Next time on Dan Plays Every Metal Gear Game Ever, the thread. You know, probably I'm, Metal Gear Fucking Acid. Not and that everyone I'm... leaves. Not that I'm accusing anyone of anything, but uh, I actually went out of the game for a second and went back in, and it said that nobody is watching this stream. <laughs> but I am! Uh, are you super crazy sure about that? Because it very specifically said no viewers. <laughs> I am watching it! Are, are you sure that a certain somebody involved <laughs> with this LP did not check out? <laughs> <laughs> roughly, uh, let's see, an hour and ten minutes ago. 
and started watching other shit. Look! Mm. <laughs> mm. I'm just saying, everybody watching this episode saw it, it said zero viewers. It does say zero views on YouTube too, and I don't know why. Hmm, I wonder for what possible purpose these things could be said about. But I have it open, it's right here, I'm watching it. Oh, that's right, we unlocked some shit that I can build off. God damn it. We I might have to LP. do another episode of this at some point, because <laughs> we unlocked some cool shit. LP's know, over. We'll, we'll figure it out. I hate everybody watching this. Fuck you, Pyroid. <laughs> fuck you, Circle Master. Yeah, fuck you, Circle Master. He's probably not even watching this. 